Gale ratings. This is Garthar as the tireless adventurer with another episode of Tour Fortress. <laughs> so a lot is different. A lot is different than was before. Actually, not very much at all. <laughs> it's okay. All right. So I've been trying to make soap so I can have clean dwarves because my dwarves are kind of starting to stink a little bit, and I realized that rendering fat is not done the same way in a Genesis mod as it is in regular Dwarf Fortress. So, what I had to figure out was where to render fat. And what I found was the culinary shop renders fat. And to do that, I simply went to the manager, made uh, render fat a job, and then built workshops until somebody did it. <laughs> So, yeah. Found it. All right. Uh, another thing that has happened. Uh, let's see. We'll go out here and we'll see. What do we got? Oh, actually. I think that was it. I was right on it. Goat skeleton, no. Monitor, no. Is it partial skeleton? Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is the easiest way to do it. Um, dead or missing. We had a ghoul thief. A fallen thief, actually two fallen thieves, and a ghoul thief come. And I killed them. In the face. I also did a little bit of work in Dwarf Fortress. Uh, playing around with some of the abilities and whatnot. And what I found was I have a great deal of Bubba's who were duplicate effort. So I have just a few carpenters, just a few masons. Um, let's see. I turned it off for anybody who didn't have a good skill in it. Um, engraver, I got this dude going, and this dude, because he's got really good skill in it. Meh. So, it is what it is. And you'll notice a lot of these are turned off except for refuse hauling, which is very important. I also turned off architecture for a lot of Bubba's, and that is also important, important, important. So, let's have us a look and see what I had done other than that. Um, let's see. Now, you notice this, my furniture stockpile is ginormous. It's massively ginormous. Um, so I, I, oh, I, I set a few more rooms to, to get dug out. And I'm smelting malachite ore, castorite ore, and hematite. Castorite is tin. And you can tell this by going to stones and hitting enter. And then you can go to like castorite. Castorite is tin. Um, malachite is copper, which is important. And then hematite is coarse iron. So these are things that, that you're going to need for your metal industry. And that's what I'm working on currently. So I'm doing all that. I'm making bronze bars using bars, which it gives me. It t basically takes tin and copper bars and makes a bronze bar. Just like in Minecraft mods. <laughs> uh, uh, making ash and making lye, which is almost done. Um, so actually, you know, let's look and see if we... What do we have stock-wise? It should be under bars. I uh, believe it's bars. Is it? No, it's not bars. It's something else. Is it miscellaneous? It might be miscellaneous. It's hot in this room. It's not miscellaneous. Where was it? Bins, boxes, cages. I don't remember. Hmm. Well, I'll figure it out, and when I do, I'll show you. But uh, until then, let's get back to work. All right, so next one, next one down is a here. And this is what I've dug out so far. Once I unpause this, my, my dwarves should get to work. Um, I have I put a few statues around the uh, the stairwell here. And nothing else really important has happened. I think a, I think a uh, merchant came, but there was nothing exciting. Needs distillable item. Uh, brewing brewing drinks right now is, is kind of a problem for me. So what I did is I when I went into the the kitchen here, and I turned off sweet pod cook. So sweet pods won't cook right now. Is it sweet? Is it hops? I can't tell. Yeah, it's hops. Basically, I'm turning off hops and sweet pods. To yeah, there we go. So I'm not brewing 
Actually, I don't want to do that. So turn off cook for those two. I'm only brewing hops right now, uh, and I don't ha I don't have any hops. So I have to I have to basically get down in the in the weeds of it and make lots of hops. So I don't have any plumps. I don't have very many plumps. So let's see if I can grow some hops. Now, well, not in spring. Can I grow it in summer? No. Can I grow it in autumn? No. Can I grow it in? No, I can't. So apparently. I can't grow. Oh, I can't grow hops. <laughs> I just have to look in the right spot. There it is. There it is. <laughs> oh, I kill me with the there it is thing. All right, so I guess spring and winter you can't grow hops. So that's good. I can I can deal with that. The the dwarves are finishing out this. I killed a lot of this dig command because they're honestly. <gasps> The Endicog Hunter has, or Toon Endicog Hunter has given birth to a boy. That's so sweet. Clean up that after birth. Thank you very much. Seeking infant. All right. Um, I did get one more request. Smoke crazy. So let's go to our dwarves and go down. See, Astesh. I'm just going to give you that guy right there. So we'll, we'll view a creature, personalize him with a Y. Go to N and make him smoke crazy. And hit enter and hit P and smoke crazy. And hit enter. And smoke crazy has been born. There you go. You will now have a dwarf in the dwarf fortress. Uh, trying to figure out where my miners are doing. Uh, he's digging. Let's zoom to creature so we can see. Oh, he's over here digging. Yeah, it shouldn't take long because the sand actually go through kind of quick. It's the stone that takes a while. Get a drink. Yummy drink. Yeah, it shouldn't take long at all. I could probably kill this. You know what? I am going to do it. I'm going to kill that. Meep, 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 meep. There it is. <laughs> there it is, he says. All right, so let's go down and... They might go back up here. I think. Yep, there they are. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna build a little danger room right here. I've got um, training spears, 30 each, getting made. Um, it's very important that you use training spears and not regular spears. I made that mistake a long time ago in a fort, and my have my entire squad in there, and it was no, not a single training training spear was made in the uh, in the danger room. And I had to do this little. I said, you put a lever. He's like, I pulled a lever. And everybody in my squad died. <laughs> it was horrible. So B, T, um, upright, capital S. And basically what we're going to do is we're, we're going to put a couple. Oh, I don't have any upright weapons. You got to get, get on that, bro. He hasn't even validated it yet. What's our manager doing anyway? Manager Quasix. Oh, God. Crikey, what's he doing, man? He's going crazy with all that stuff. Void spawn, void spawn, pause the game. All right, so we have a let's see what we have here. We have one void spawn. Let's zoom the creature. All right, um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sign the mechanical culmination to kill the void spawn. He's chasing. He's chasing that dude. Ah, oh, get off him! Get him! Get him! Who, who's he chasing? Let's see. <laughs> he's, he's like, I'm running so fast. Tekid, a milker. He's a milker. Oh my god, he's the legendary milker. The legendary milker is under attack. The legendary milker is under attack. Does he have any wounds yet? No, he has no wounds yet. Run, milker! Run! Run, milker! Why are you going that way? Run to safety. The safety of the fort. They're gonna they're gonna die. Oh stop. Right, let's 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 have a look at some bubbas. Alright, I got a mechanical spider, which is beat to crap. Urist. Lead. Ustooth. This is some weird names, dude. Come on, kill, 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 kill. Stop. Let me let me 
turn this game down a little bit. It's too high right now. So let's go to combat reports. The void spawn is fighting. Uh, the recruit is fighting. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, nice. But the attack glances away. So not nice. The recruit stands up. <gasps> oh, that's crazy. Uh, the recruit is caught in a burst of steam. The recruit... Okay, so he... Oh man, he's glancing away, glancing away, glancing away. None of these attacks are hitting. None of these attacks are hitting. Well, that's a Nith. The Nith is fighting. The voice one releases a grip on it. Oh no, he put venom in the recruit's blood. Everybody kill him already. Kill him in the... F oh, he's dead. Oh gosh, what happened to this guy? <laughs> he is totally toast. Oh my god, he's unconscious. He's winded. His head is winded! No way! Oh my god. His health, let's look at it. He cannot breathe. He's lost the ability to grasp and, and stand. So we gotta get a dude out there to pick up the wounded. So let's see, do we have anybody re retrieving wounded? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Here they come. Who's he? What's he doing? He is general. He's cleaning. <laughs> I'm gonna go out here clean around this dead dude. Oh, he died. Oh, he died. That's horrible. Oh, he died. Gray the Avenger. We will miss you. Mostly because now you're dead. Health. He has no health problems. He's currently, he's fine. That's not Great Avenger. Never mind. Oh, that's. I'm looking at the wrong dude. Oh, dear. It's Urist. So, Great Avenger's still alive. My bad. Sorry, Gray. You're still alive. Emergency crisis averted. Emergency crisis averted. Um. I need a new dwarf. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, B for build, T for traps, capital T, capital S for upright. I don't I don't have any. What is going on, Mr. Man? Alright, so it is actually started. So, there we go. They're going out to... He's been found dead? He's been found dead? Yes, of course, he's been found dead. Some migrants have arrived! Sweet! Alright, so we got some migrants. And speaking of migrants, we have a little bit that we're going to do here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to channel this out up here, up, up top. And you're like, why are you channeling that out up top? And I'm saying to you, you'll see in a minute. So, let's go down to here. Actually, let's have a look-see. Actually, let's let it run while they get done. And then we'll do a migration wave. Read dwarves! 23, not too shabby. 23. Let's see if I get anybody of any worth. I got a, um, I got a weaver. <laughs> they get any more legendary milkers to replace the... Oh, no. I guess not. Legendary milkers dead. The legendary milker is dead. Or I turned it off and... No, he's right there. Yeah, I, I turned it off. It's not an ability I needed, so. All right, so that is that is good. That is good. So I got 17 idle dwarves. You know, I can probably do BD, DBD on this and dump a lot of stuff. Uh, and let's go down to there. It won't dump items that I've placed. So that is good. So build a bed. Got a couple of beds here missing. I think that is it. Yes. No, it's not. Oh, one more. One more. Perfect. All right. So let's go back up here. And we're looking for... I got a mason, carpenter, carpenter, carpenter. Okay, so these guys are, are working across the board. I should have two carpenters. So let me see. Let's remove migration wave. 
and just sort by nothing. We'll see how many carpenters we have. All right, I have plenty of carpenters. Plenty of carpenters. Let's see how many masons I've got. I have two. Spieler Vitvitten, who is a legendary mason. Yes, you are. <laughs> yes. Okay, that's, that's weird. I'm stopping. I'm stopping. All right. Um, migration wave again, because I really like to sort by that. And then we come down here, and we're going to go to Moultrie. And we're going to look. we got crap. we got a lot of Dodgers and a Axe Dwarf. That's it. <laughs> Super. Super. I'm kicking back now. I'm relaxing. I'm getting comfortable because it's Dwarf Fortress time. Open the presents and see what's inside. All right. So, I forget. What is this? This is a bar block stockpile. Okay. And this is where I've been interring the uh, the dead. Lee Baron died. Did I rename Lee Baron? I didn't know Lee Baron died. Hmm. Strange. I could have swore Lee Baron 1980 was alive. When did he die? Well, Lee Baron, we can't have you not being alive, so let's... Let's give you... Hey, Carpenter! That's a nice safe job. I've already forgotten how to spell your name. Well, why don't I just look at my list here? Oh, no! No, 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 no. Lee Baron, 1980. I, if I'll fix it if I got it wrong. I think it's Lee Baron. I could be wrong. It is now. <laughs> he was one of the ones I named before anybody requested a name because he's so he's so chatty in the comments. I figured I'd give him some props. I had to take my hat off. It was just too freaking hot in here. It's like crazy hot. All right. So, hmm. Let's continue to look here. Maybe I missed somebody else. So, Arist. Available, available, available. First. Tekid. It almost seems like getting a dwarf named after you is a surefire way to get said dwarf killed. You know what I mean? <laughs> Alright, so let's go back up top here and we'll issue the cut some more stinking trees command. There we go. I don't need a lot. I just need a few. Oh, we can do the, pa the plants. The pants. We could do pants. All right. F1. Go down one. We're coming over here. We're looking around. We don't see anything nasty. Stray goat gave birth to a kid. This should be done. Hmm. What is my... What are my carpenters doing? Good question. Hmm. It's a very good question. Well, let's go back up here and see if we can do it. B, capital T, capital S. We do have them. So I am going to put one there. Actually, we can do ten. So... Hmm. That's six. 
deselect. Okay, so there's five right there, which is good. Ah! And then I forget, shift enter select all. Oh, what is done? I forgot what done is. Done. Deselecting. All right. So basically, he's going to put those upright spears in there. And I need to build a pressure plate. Hmm. I forget. Where is the pressure plate? I guess I could always do a lever. It's not going to kill anything. But I, I'm pretty certain. A slab. Oh, we got to build to build it. That's why. That's why I didn't see it. So it would be and pressure plate would be under I believe capital T pressure plate right there. And it needs mechanisms, of course. That's great. I wish I had some mechanisms. That would be super. All right. Do I have a mechanics workshop? I should. I do. I have one. Let's see. Where is it? My guess is in here. There it is. Okay. So I need to make mechanisms. A whole bunch. Need to get to work on that. And they're, they're currently dumping all the, the, the getting rid ofs, which is good for me. We still need tables. My drinks are dwindling. I do have brew drink command on repeat or on, on the manager, so even if he has nothing to brew, he'll still hold the task until he does. Mmm. Drinky, drinky. I guess I can open some of these bedrooms up. That one's open. That one's open. That one's open. Yeah, I did a little bit of this off camera. So you guys didn't have to watch this, but apparently you still get to watch it. Apparently. Yeah. Okay. So I'm silly. I think that was pretty much already already known though. Alright. Oh, this is missing the bed. It's a good thing I found that. It's a good thing I found that. Okay, let's see. Not missing. Got a sheriff. Oh, I'm still curious what a dungeon master is. <laughs> it's dungeon master, of course. Silly man. Alrighty. It's zero idlers right now because we're dragging so much stone out. B T capital S. Oh, at least six here. No, I only got three. Come on, dudes. Read dwarfs. Carpenterers. Sort by nothing, people. Carpenter, what are you doing? Store item in the stockpile, dump item. Ah, uh, because it's marked as refuse, that's why. Mm, I'm a silly little biscuit. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel that that dump command. We wanna remove D, which is capital. Capital D! Yeah, and there was a couple of comments that people were like, uh, it's kind of hard to follow this game. You know, you should try uh, Towns, or you should try Nomoria. They're a lot like Dwarf Fortress. And I've always been a big fan of games like Dwarf Fortress, but I've also been a fan of playing the game that other games attempt to emulate. This game 
is a little bit cerebral. I'm not trying to say that I'm super smart because I'm not. Mm. And I get stuff wrong all the time. But it's still one of those games where you kind of do some thinking. You have to do some thinking. You have to do some planning. And this is not really a game as much as it is a simulator. Um, because the objective of this game is not to win, but to take the longest to lose. And that's the kind of game that I like. Um, not, it's not impossible, but it does get difficult. I'm not going to lie. The longest I've ever had a fort go, I believe, was 103 years, I think. I'm fairly certain. I'm really curious when Lee Baron died. Meh. Alright, so everybody's taking us FDB reclaim. I'll just reclaim this square right here and I'm good. And then they'll start using that for the closer stuff. And that is fine. That is A-OK. -okay. So people are starting to do their thing. Uh, carpenters are back to work. This is my masons. I got my, my masons have no jobs. We can't have that. So we're going to go with rock. Actually, let's see if I can do this. Marble block. No, can't do marble block. I'll tell you what I'll do. Let's just do rock blocks. And we'll just do 30. And hopefully it works out. <laughs> uh, we're also going to need... Um, rock tables. 30. Rock thrones. 30. That should be good for now, because as you can see, this is starting to empty out a little bit, but not much. We still have a buttload of beds in there, um, all kinds of junk. And DBC, and now it's all claimed. Perfect. All right, drinks are starting to starting to get a little flustered. What's this? A Sylvan caravan. Oh, Sylvan, great. Super. These guys never have anything worth a crap. Never have anything worth a crap, poop. Poopity crap. I like saying that. It's fun. <laughs> it's fun to say poop. Alright. Um, let's see. What do we have here? Alright. Um, I need a lever. So B, capital T, L. And I'm going to put this lever right here. I still need those mechanisms, those mechanicisms. All right, who's my mechanic? I should have a fairly decent mechanic. Uh, that is, oh yeah, that is Ast. He's in the military though. Quasix is in there, so let's turn off Quasix. Let's turn off that guy and let's turn off furnishing oper furnace operator and toggle that, except for refuse. Commit pending changes. And now we should have Kel go do the thing that he was doing. So he should... The dead walk. Hide while you can. What the snoot? Oh, are you kidding me? Not good. Alright. Um, this is not going to be good, people. Alright. So military alerts. Inside now. Everybody. And we're going to let the dead. What's this? Oh, are we. Are you serious? What is that? Is that a Dalesman? Yeah, I'm going to look at this guy. Dune Dweller, prone to great ambition. His quite his quite sparse hair is extremely long. He is weak. Oh, well, I ain't worried about that. He's weak. Um, What just blew up? <laughs> Something just exploded. What is that? 
These humans are the, remain are the remaining splinter of an ancient empire that was destroyed from within by their own lust. Incredibly muscular. <laughs> he just, he's like, oh, I am aware of something. Yes, you are aware of something. Get inside. And we're going to need this Sylvan caravan to die of I <laughs> death. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. I, I have my military... <laughs> Doesn't even have. Oh, uh, half of my military doesn't even have weapons. Oh, uh, equipment. Oh, she has one. He has one. Uh, you got armor and headwear. Yeah. Oh, this, well, everybody's got weapons. That's good. So let's just go ahead and throw a couple of late bloomers in here. Uh, positions. And uh, you're going in there. You're going in there. You're going in there. I don't even care. You're going in there. 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 And you should be active. There we go. So now everybody will become active. And these. What is that? What is that? I want to see this. This right here in the, in the very beginning. What is that? It's a Sylvan corpse. Um. Okay. <laughs> Good luck killing your own. Uh, I don't envy you, my brother. They're going to freak out here in a second. Oh, my God! Dude, why did you let him in? <laughs> they let him in. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, attack from list. Um, uh, let's do it with E and F right now. <laughs> it's gonna be so painful. Kill him! Ah! Ah! <laughs> this is crazy. Oh my god! We're all gonna die. We're all gonna die. We're dying right now. Siege is happening in front of our faces. Military. Holy crap! I'm actually not doing too shabby. I am getting like. Sieged. Oh, yours forever is toast. <laughs> Sorry. My bad. Something just blew up again. Oh, and everybody who dies comes back. That is not good. Oh, get down for a mood, bro. I appreciate that, Mr. Wubble. <laughs> way, to bring, way to bring it. Do I have any military left? I do have a few. And they're fighting their buns off. He's holding that door. Look at this dude holding his door. We gotta. I'm gonna. I'm gonna look at this guy. He's holding his door like a champ. He is holding his door like a champ. Let's look at his wounds, cause he's probably screwed up. He is very. <laughs> he's very unhappy. This sucks. I hate this. This is the worst job I have ever had. All right. Who's this? Uh, he's dizzy and numb. Looks like he's lost a leg. This guy has lost everything. <laughs> oh, that's a goat. Never mind. All right, this is. You just, yeah, they're in. They're in now. Everybody's everybody's toast. Let's look. Uh, <laughs> Momas and Ast, Kib. You guys are totally owning it. You two are just making it happen. Just want to say, it's pretty epic. Everybody's gonna die soon. And here they come. And he's claimed a workshop. Mr. Wubbles has claimed a carpentry workshop. That's great. Thank you. Trying to manage a siege, if you don't mind. Mm, not good, yo. I don't have any military left. I do. Where are you guys at? Momas. Where is my military? This guy's he's still got the job. Let's zoom the creature where he's at. He's what is he doing down here? <laughs> he's he's over here. Look, right here. What are you doing, bro? He's like, Well, I was thirsty. <laughs> hold the line. What part of hold the line are you having a hard time with? Oh my god, look at that horde of undead. This game is over. 